someone here who we've been so excited to talk to. Ma'am, can we please have you join us this Facebook Live, please? I must say, huge fan. Oh my God, she's actually introducing herself to me. Is like I would be put to so much shame if I didn't know who you were as an anchor. I think we're all such huge fans of you, even if we're not from the same language. So, Shri Mukhi, ma'am, how do you feel today about being here at Simon? I request you to call me Shri Mukhi. <laughs> Shri Mukhi, please tell us how do you feel about being here at Pantaloon Simon 2018. It's great because uh, this is my second time, and it feels like uh, I am coming to my home again because oh. the last time when I hosted it was in Dubai. So later it was in Malaysia, Abu Dhabi. So again, the fourth time, I mean like uh, the second time that I'm hosting is again Dubai. Correct. So it feels really nice and uh, all the place like Lapita Parks or resorts is making me feel like a holiday that I've come <laughs> for. Yeah. I think we always know if you're going to host a show where what the energy level is going to be, what the entertainment is going to be, everybody will have expectations. But right now we're live on Facebook, right? So everybody, even back home in India, are tuned in to watch us. So what would you like to tell your fans who've been so supportive. Uh, I would say like uh, the past two years have been really amazing and especially that is because of my fans. Uh, I, I knew uh, the uh, standards that I've, I mean like the energy that I've put in, the same kind of uh, uh, energy that you have put me back in loving me. So I, I am here on this stage is only because of you. So I'm looking forward and I promise to give definitely better best and every day uh, it is only for you guys most importantly oh, that's so nice and i must tell you you look like a princess who's going to go to a ball so pretty could you tell us about your outfit who styled you uh, i am wearing reka skotyor uh, this is by kirtana sunil uh, my best friend uh, should i look at this camera or that Whichever mom, whichever camera you look at, we are ready to look at you right back. So, yeah, Kirtana has done my clothes. She's been doing my clothes since two years. So, oh. this is made with a lot of love and uh, affection. I think we can see it right there. But with you, we would like to play a little game. I think you must have heard of it. It's called Never Have I Ever. I know, right? She's just always ready for, ready for anything. <laughs> so, I have a couple of cards here. So, you just have to pick a couple and then we'll just ask you questions off that. Okay? okay? If you yeah. could just Never have I ever partied so hard that I couldn't wake up in time for work or shoot the next day. Has this happened in Sri Mukhi's life? Yes. <laughs> yes. So what did you do? Only a couple of times. I remember then I, I regret doing it so much that I made sure that even if I get... I mean, even if I party and get very socially responsibly drunk, uh, I make sure that I get back to the work. But I'm, I'm very disciplined. I, I guess it's only one time that has happened to me. Only once, yeah. That's not bad. That's fair enough. So sweet. Another one. Never have I ever been starstruck like I am right now. <laughs> has it happened to you? So sweet. Yes, and that too, it exactly happened here at Saima because we get to see many actors from Tamil, Malayalam, uh, Telugu and Hindi also. I remember Neil, Nitin, Mukesh, everybody from the Bollywood also have, was here. So I was starstruck. I was speechless for the first time when I first met uh, Prithvi from Malayalam. Uh -huh. Yeah, uh, I remember Aya just released at that point of time okay. with Rani Mukherjee and same kind of crush or love that Rani Mukherjee had for uh, Prithvi, it was for me. We both were in the same lift and I was like... <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Did you talk to him? Did you tell him? No, he was so sweet to say me hi. Then I was so speechless that I said, hi. Hi. That's it. And I cursed myself after going back to my room that why couldn't you talk? I know, right? I know. Okay, so your final question. Yeah. What would you like to pick? Never have I ever lied to my trainer about a cheat meal. I do it every <laughs> time. I do it every time. I remember I having biryani, sweets, and idlis, dosas, everything. And I, I am on diet very much. On diet. I followed everything. It's just that I couldn't even eat what you gave me to eat. So, yeah, I've done it most of the times. Oh, but I don't think you need any diet. You're just gorgeous always. Thank you so much for being here. And we're super excited. I know you're going to set the pace right and the show is going to be a huge hit. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you so much.